Hello everybody, this is Scott here, Scott's got Turns Warren. Today I'm going to be inspecting the bees yet again. Uh, I'm gonna put in footage at the end of me and of me requeening that hive over there and everything. That will explain some of what I'm gonna be doing today. Anyway, but let's get going. I'm just gonna set this up here so I can rest frames on it. And we're in. I gotta look through the top box really quickly. Top super does not appear to have anything in it. Which is a little, I won't say unsettling, however I will say disappointing. We let them have honey in here. I want honey. Good, they're building comb onto this. They're gonna need a bit of a reshaping of this comb though, considering that they are building it out like so. That is a no-no. For them to build it straight. I'm gonna put this frame back in now that I've removed the large quantities of comb they had added onto it between the frames. Uh, and when they're starting to build comb, and if they're not doing it uh, correctly, as a beekeeper, this already unnatural environment it isn't a bad thing for you to tell them how to do it better. Okay, let's take off this amount of propolis first. Propolis is one of the stickiest substance, substances you will ever, I've ever encountered. It's like not uncured two-part epoxy or something in its stickiness. Here, let me give these girls a... I haven't opened them in about two weeks because school was crazy last week. So, it's going to be interesting to see how they're doing. Look how much honey there is. Just got to get some of this. Mm. Good? Oh, Amazing. Try this. It is excellent. Oh wow, that's like eating candy. It is. <laughs> Doesn't like honey fresh out of the hive. Oh boy, it's like eating a flower covered in sugar. Yep. Thing with smokers is you can pick them back up. You cannot pick up, however, a frame if you drop it. And that frame is just a honey frame, so it's not really overly interesting. Oh, yeah, that's just filled with honey. That is a good thing. Check on the next frame. In order for me to make it easy, they glued this whole hive together. Oh boy. Nectar, honey. If I just say nectar, honey on a frame, that's all there is on it. Honey and nectar. Good, they opened the queen cage that I put in there. That means that they are now have a queen. That means they are queen right. Oh boy, I hate doing this, but I'm gonna have to cut out. All right, so my dad just got a bowl. He put all this extra honey that I'm having to scrape off because they're, th this frame was spaced incorrectly. Now you can see how much they've built, built it askew. So I'm going to write this. And it's going to involve the loss of potentially a lot of honey. Unless I do it correctly. So, 
first, let's take a look at the frame itself. What do I need to take off? This part here. There are, that ought to be enough to get them to rebuild it correctly this time. Uh, out on this frame, it's just nectar and honey. Ah, boy, these girls have been doing lots of stuff with this eye. Oh, boy. And you know what? Oh, boy. School just got crazy, and I really am disappointed about that because <laughs> if I'd have inspected them sooner, I wouldn't have itch frames like this, which are really terrible. That is a lot of honey. Oh, yeah. very much a lot. And then if you look at the next frame, it is also horribly uneven. Is this something where you would just leave a frame out? Uh, and balance it? Okay, so. So, and then you see that you get frames like this. I'm not going to deal with that right now as it is not an issue. However, in the future, I am going to be taking steps to prevent that. And I will need your help to move this box off. Oh. And that's just more nectar and honey. Now, back to where everything was. Okay, now that that box is off. Back inside. The reason I'm taking all this off is because it's brood comb and it is not the most usable things. Here they come. Worker brood, brood frame. This means my queen is doing good. This means my hive is back from the dead. And also indicating that laying workers never took hold. Never drop a frame of bees. You will regret it. They had a, a book on how to get stung, that would be page one. Drop a frame of bees. They have brood, they have worker brood, which means that I don't have laying workers. I have a queen because the cage is open. So these girls are doing good. The rest of it is just nectar and honey, so I'm not actually going to inspect it for fear of further disturbing the girls. So that's the bottom box inspected. Okay. All right, so that's that hive inspected. On to this hive, which will be in the next episode. So you'll see that next week or later this week. I don't know, I'm almost going to be doing some other videos. Videos soon. Oh boy, it's hot out here. So yes, I'm going to now do this hive, but you'll see it in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share. Bye-bye.